These uh, Arctic temperatures really put stress on homes and people who have to work outside. Extra clothing for workers and extra insulation for homes are some of the ways to try to cut down on cold weather issues. John Lorison shows us other ways you can avoid problems inside and out. When you're up in a bucket, uh, it can really whip through you. No matter what the thermometer says, XL Energy workers have to be ready. Sometimes that means working in a bucket in a 25 below wind chill. Extra layers and frequent breaks are required to keep warm. If we have certain jobs, we'll put more guys on it, uh, so then they can kind of rotate through the trucks too. So then you kind of keep everybody safe, warm, and uh, you know still be able to get the job done. Plumbers may spend more time inside, but they are no less busy. Calls for frozen or burst pipes are nonstop right now. When the temperatures get down this low, it, it gets crazy. Dustin Hines is with Hero Plumbing, Heating, and Cooling. During a cold snap like this, he'll respond to hundreds of calls for busted pipes. A common cause is poor insulation that allows frigid air to creep in and freezes pipes in certain locations. But Dustin says there are ways to keep your pipes in one piece. Turn your heat up just a tiny bit. Uh, let, let a faucet drip in every bathroom, not just one, because that water needs to be moving throughout the entire system. For Dustin, the record cold means business, but he wouldn't mind seeing temperatures creep back to average at least. It's always kind of a relief when it starts to warm up and get this cold weather out of here. In Minneapolis, John Lordson, WCCO 4 News. Another tip, although this applies to next year, so maybe mark your calendar now. They say get a furnace tune up before winter. A faulty furnace can also contribute to frozen pipes. We'll, of course, keep you covered through this bitter blast on TV and streaming with weather updates on CBSN Minnesota.